There are several reasons why there are no reviews on predictors in this channel. One is because normally you wouldn't trust a YouTube channel if you buy a 50,000 euro projector, but this is the kind of projector I work with mainly. Secondly, I only can review the ones that I buy myself because well, suppliers don't send me their stuff. And third, I really don't like scripted videos, so, so I don't really want to write down what I... Well, here we go, because this one is special. It's Epson's EBL200F, the full HD version of their laser-powered LCD projectors. It's a three LCD projector with a laser light source that lasts 30,000, and if you put it on full output, at least 20,000 hours which is an absolute lot and you will definitely not change the lamp on this projector at any time. So this projector is clearly aimed at the installation or fixed installation market, which you can see from the connectivity. There is USB, of course, uh, RS-232, Ethernet, uh, Wi-Fi 5. There is analog video if you want to and two HDMI ports. Also, there is a lot of audio connectivity because clearly Epson understood that the built-in speaker is not the kind of speaker that you want to use in a projector or in, a, in an environment. So you will clearly connect some other speaker system to it. The lens hood is a, well, shifting thing that can turn off the projector automatically. Focus and zoom are manual. Zoom goes from 1.33 to 2.16 by one, which is a lot actually. And then there is this mechanical slider that actually electronically uh, regulates the horizontal keystone because uh, vertical keystone is automatic if you want to and this is just a shortcut to the menu. I don't think anybody will use this but uh, you will clearly use the menu with your remote. Laser and 3 LCD. Well they create a stunning image. I'll more for that later on but it is the reason why I put this projector in a review on this channel. The bottom is full of screw holes. There is uh, VESA and other screw mounting options here, so you can obviously mount this projector with anything, and it can be mounted at any angle if you want to. So the air output on the front is pretty helpful. On the sides, there is a really easy to access filtering system through a very silent ventilation system. It goes from 28 dB in echo mode to 37 dB in full mode with 4500 lumens. Now there are built-in options to manipulate your image like for instance the easy corner pin which is accessible through your remote control and you can set up your projector just like this. Then there is something that you might call a Bezier correction or something. So it does cushion corrections with uh, certain points that you can access. And if that wasn't enough, there is an option to use a grid and then correct every single point of your image in a grid, which is an absolute power tool if you set up some pr projection and you want to correct everything on the projector and not in your source. So if you don't have a server, if you run just a simple player and you still want to do corrections on an uneven wall, this is your option. I really like the overall color science on Epson's L200 series. It is really satisfying. Skin tones are great and the vividness of the colors is also really stunning. Contrast can be adjusted really easily and nicely and it goes well on almost any projectable background. So if you have to adjust to some other colors of your wall or some temperature in the room, you're gonna be fine with this projector. So why do I put a review on a channel where there are usually no reviews? Well, in this case, I really like the projector. The EBL200F is one of the projectors I would buy for myself. And actually, I bought it myself because I paid real money for this. Nobody's paying me to say that. I'm just really happy with the product and this is why I put it here. Subscribe to this channel if you wanna learn more about projections. And maybe I put another review on this because um, actually the mount that I bought is pretty good also.